Hey folks, John with Baker Boy. Hey, I wanted to share another new product idea. Um, here we have the Baker Boy baked 12 inch white subs. Go ahead and take your sharp paring knife and cut five circular holes in the bread, just like this. This is what's gonna hold the meatballs from rolling out and going all over and make a mess on uh, the plate. It has a nice presentation and it also uh, packs really well if a person wants to uh, overwrap the subs in it like a deli case or something like that. So go ahead and cut the bread. You want about a oh, two inch hole, five holes across and prepare it that way. After I get the bread done, then I will take my melted garlic butter. We will garlic butter this bread just like that. Okay, and be generous with the garlic butter. Don't worry about it. I mean, that's what makes it nice and tasty. Put your parsley on there just like that. We're gonna put our marinara sauce on here. I like to fill the holes with the marinara. Okay, just like that. And I'm putting probably an ounce in each hole. As you guys can see this, like that. Then you take your meatballs. These are still kind of frozen. I like to kind of use them when they're frozen. They're a lot easier to handle. Get those down in there like that. Alrighty. And then we put a little more sauce and a little more cheese on top and we're ready to go. I will throw these in the oven at 375, 400, right in there for probably about 10 minutes. So, and again, if you guys need any help, any questions, any uh, ideas, please contact Baker Boy, um, the Baker Boy website, and we're here to help. We have our meatball subs all fixed and ready to go to hit the oven. So I will throw them in at 375 for about eight to 10 minutes until the cheese is melted. Here we got our uh, meatball sub made with the Baker Boy 12 inch white sub roll. And go ahead, it's ready to be served. If you need anything from Baker Boy as far as any information on our product line, please uh, don't hesitate to check the website out at bakerboy.com.